Hi friends and welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah. In today's video, I have a clean with me, my living room edition. It's been a hot minute since I've touched the living room, so we really kind of need to get that cleaned up and ready to go for the week ahead. This video is in collaboration with a ton of other amazing content creators here on YouTube. I will have a link to the playlist down in the description box below. And it is hosted by Mama Jesse J as well as Burton the Beard. So thank you to you ladies for hosting. This was a lot of fun to film, right up my alley. So definitely check out their channels. I'll have links to their channels down in my description box below as well. But without further ado, we're going to go ahead and jump into things and get things cleaned up. So let me know how everybody's doing. How is your week going so far? It's been just a long week here for me. I've been enjoying the weather, but I'm really tired. You know the saying, you need a vacation from your vacation. We had a great time this past weekend. We actually went out um, to New Hampshire and we visited Santa's Village and Storyland and it was just a great time. My son loved every minute of it. It was so worth it for my husband and I. Um, we were able to stay in Mount Washington. There's a hotel they have out there, so that was really nice. We had scenic views. It was much needed, but of course, when you come back, there's always that ever big to-do list, So, which is why I wanted to tackle my living room today. I've been doing one room a day and then some maintenance tasks throughout the week to keep the house in pretty decent shape, which thankfully it is. Let me know if you're willing to share your weekly routine and what that looks like for you. Now, once everything was dusted, I went back with the Mrs. Myers and just kind of went over uh, the surfaces with that. Typically, I do section by section when it comes to my rooms. It just kind of keeps me on task, keeps me on track. But this time around, I dusted all the furniture first. I just felt like kind of changing it up a little bit. So once the fireplace and the little DVD case was done, I moved on to the, um, the shelves. And this is pretty much where I put a lot of my summer decor. Again, I don't have a ton of it. But, you know, I do have it out here and it just makes it kind of feel like that beachy theme and everything like that. Our hope is to get to the beach a few more times this summer. Um, I'm going to be heading into work very soon to work on health records. If you're newer to my channel, um, I am a school nurse, so right now I am in my off season. I have the time off. We can choose to work summer school. I just usually like to be at home with my family and friends. That's what I choose to do, but we are required to go in um, a couple of days in the summer. And for me, I have to go in to review health records. So that'll be upcoming. I also have two new nurses to train. Um, and we're getting a brand new nursing office. So there's a lot going on this summer. So I'll be in the office a little bit more than usual, but it's all good. We have such wonderful blessings coming our way in relation to the school nursing office. So I'm super excited. But let me know what some of your plans are as I can't believe we're entering mid-July, but let me know if you guys are going on any vacations, what you're looking forward to most for this summer. All right, this is usually one of my favorite parts when I'm cleaning the living room. Not favorite as in like whatever, but I usually find some really good stuff back here. And today is no exception. Lots of crumbs as you guys can see. This is always my reminder to all families, whether or not you have children, animals, maybe you just live alone with a friend. Um, move your couches. Let's see. Yep, and there we go. There it is. 
So lots of debris over here. I'm gonna get all this vacuum then wash up. I'll move the other couch and finish off with the windows. It is always ridiculously satisfying to vacuum up all the crazy crumbs that lay behind the couch. <laughs> At least there were no toys or anything this time, which is always pleasant. Um, but I was able to vacuum this up and then you'll see me wash it in a little bit with the old cedar mop. Um, it's been my go-to as of late and it gets the job done. But let me know what you guys use down below. Also, I wanted to take the opportunity, like I mentioned, um, if you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome. I'm happy to have you. Many of you might be here from the collab, and I'm super excited to get to know and meet so many of you here on YouTube. I've met so many amazing individuals who are just so positive, and I'm happy I've met you all. But I do a lot of cleaning and organizing here in my channel, some decluttering. Every now and then, I'll be able to put a lifestyle video out there, and you'll get a glimpse of motherhood for me. But I am married and have a son, and as I mentioned earlier, I'm a school nurse. I absolutely love what I do typically I do work Monday through Friday so a lot of the times in my channel I do what I can with the time that I have this summer I've been blessed to have the summer to myself and my family so you're seeing a few more videos than I normally put out but again if you guys are new I would love if you subscribed it, it, this way you don't miss out on any of the new content and we can chat in the comments down below happy to have you and if you're a returning subscriber I'm happy that you stopped in and I hope that you give a playlist a look down below So one of the last things I'm doing in the living room is just vacuuming the sections that I didn't and then I'm going to just finish mopping up and that'll pretty much finish off the living room. So realistically, if I hadn't have been filming and stuff, obviously to move the camera, this really only took me about 20 minutes of my time um, and I was pretty happy with that. All in all, it could probably take me around 10 or 15 on a good day, but this really needed a deeper clean. Um, I'll be doing an extreme deep clean very very soon in August so stay tuned for that. I always do that right before the fall season. <laughs> Alright my friends, so this is bringing us to the end of the video. I wish I had smell vision through here, <laughs> but what, and just, just a difference. It feels nice and light and fresh. There were a ton of crumbs behind the couches that really needed vacuuming, so I'm glad I was able to vacuum and wash the floors. And then just give everything a really good dust because it absolutely needed that. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And again, thanks to the hosts, uh, Britt the Beard, Britt and the Beard, excuse me, and uh, Mama Jessie J. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.